Happening tonight, a nationally televised program will profile this missing Encinitas man who disappeared more than two years ago. 10 News reporter Jennifer Jensen has his family struggle to find him. Devastated and haunted, that's how this Encinitas woman describes her emotions as she searches for her missing brother. He was the kind of guy that called each one of us in the family every single day, if not a couple times a day. As we first reported last September, a then 29-year-old Cameron Remmer disappeared in San Francisco in October 2011. He was in the Bay Area on business for about 10 days, purchasing medicinal marijuana when he was escorted out of the Fairmont Hotel after being in the hotel bar. His belongings were still being held by the Bell Desk when he vanished. He was escorted out for essentially erratic behavior and no one's ever heard from him again. His story and his family's search for him now the focus of a Discovery Channel investigative piece on a Sunday night episode of Last Seen Alive. We're definitely feeling somewhat at a dead end at this point. The episode was shot in January and will be aired this evening and a few more times in the days ahead. It's just frustrating. It's like if it, we don't want to be in denial that something terrible could have happened to him, but where's the body? She says her brother is bipolar and suffered with psychosis. He was not taking his medication when he disappeared. While they stay focused on finding him and clearly not giving up hope, they hope this national exposure will give them answers. I'm going to be really hopeful when it's airing that it's just, I mean, just someone somewhere sees it and recognizes him and can give us some sort of information. Jennifer Jensen, 10 News. Yeah, we definitely wish them the best.